beautiful people and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a, a shopping haul, a fall haul. I actually have no idea what I'm going what I'm going to call this, but I did pick up some fall and Halloween related items. So, I think I'm just going to call it a fall haul. So, that's that's what it is. Okay, so over the weekend, I went to Marshalls, Target, the Dollar Tree. I went to a farmer's market slash flea market. Um, so I picked up quite a few little things. I picked up some house decor, some clothing and toys for Manny. Um, most of the toys, he's already open and they're, they're lost and back here in this craziness. Um, so I won't be able to show those, but I did want to just kind of share with you guys what I picked up because I don't know, I like watching what other people buy, so I'm, I'm just assuming you guys do too. If you're new, my name is Andrea. Um, I am a motherhood and foodie and haul channel. I make cooking videos. Um, I do grocery hauls, shopping hauls. I do motherhood vlogs. I do a little bit of everything, but my niche, I guess, is motherhood. So if you're new, thank you so much for stopping by. And let's go ahead and jump into the haul. So I guess I'll show you guys what I picked up from Target first because we all love a, t a good Target moment. So the first thing that I got was this adorable, it's like, um, I don't know, it feels like fleece or something. Let's see. I don't know, it's like a fleece, like little pullover. And it's super soft and like warm. And it's of course Toy Story and it says, you got a friend in me. And I just love this like camel mustardy color. Um, so I picked up that for Manny for the, when it actually starts getting cooler here. I also grabbed this cute little guy. So he was, um, was he in the dollar spot? I can't remember. He was $5, so I'm thinking he was in the dollar spot. But honestly, I wish I would have picked up more of these because first of all, I love this. Um, I think it's eucalyptus, but I love these eucalyptus plants and I really wish I would have gotten more and just $5 for this is so affordable. I've been looking for little plants to like put pops of color around the, ho around the house and they're all so outrageous and I'm just like, why would I spend $20 on something this size that's not even real? Like, I don't know, but I found this little guy at Target and I love him and I wish I would have got more of him. I also picked up one of these shoe racks. So we had a shoe rack very similar to this. It was a little bit smaller that I picked up from Five Below a couple years ago. And recently Manny decided he was gonna step on it and break it. So I picked this one up and I actually already have it set up right there. Um, so we needed this for our shoes because we don't like we don't like to wear shoes in the house, so I like to kick off the shoes in the front door and then have somewhere nice and neat to place them. I don't like when they're just like all around. Um, so I picked up a new one of those. So I also grabbed some of these super cute stamps. So I got some Halloween and some Thanksgiving type ones. Um, for those of you that don't know, I do make the hand stamped stacked books. Um, and I'm always looking for new ways to be creative with those. So I picked these up so I can make some sets with these little stamps. Um, I also grabbed, so so for most of my life, I've had like kind of wavy hair. Um, when I was younger, it was a little bit more ringlety, like, you know, typical little kid, like curly, I guess you could say. Um, but since having Manny, I don't know, I guess my hormones have changed because my hair is trying to be curly again. So I picked up these two items. I've heard really good things about this. Um, gosh, somebody recently was just talking about this and I wish, I wish, I wish I could remember who it was because I would give you a shout out. Um, if I remember, I'll just put your little name at the bottom, your name at the bottom of the screen. But this is the Three Minute Miracle Curls Deep Conditioner. And then I went ahead and picked up this um, Sprunching Mousse Leave-In Conditioner. Um, so I'm hoping to kind of bring my curls alive on days that I want to do that and hopefully these two items will help okay so the next couple items that I got from Target um I also picked up this cute little witch hat 
It has like glitter on the side and it looks like that. So it's like cute for like a tiered tray or like a bookshelf or something. This was also in the little dollar spot. It was $3 and I just love it. I love witch stuff around Halloween. Witch and ghost stuff is like my favorite. Um, and then I also grabbed some of these kids face masks. Um, so Manny actually does really good with his face mask when he does have to wear it, which I typically don't take him in a lot of places just to avoid him having to wear it. Um, but I like the little disposable ones just because, you know, once they get dirty, you can just toss them. But I just like to have these on hand. I do have some like washable masks for him as well, but I don't know. These are just easier to just keep in the car and grab one if I need it. I think, I think that's everything from Target. Okay, so next I'm just gonna quickly show you. I did go to um, Five Below and I picked up a few things, but I seem to only have one of the things here because I guess the other things were toys for me. <laughs> so I already gave them to him, but I picked up this um, cute little phone case and I grabbed it because, so Matt, he calls me his sweet. So he says like my sweet instead of Andrea. So I just thought that was super cute and it says like sweet on there and it's got little, what is it, Swarovski um, crystals and it's just like a clear case but I thought that would be really cute for my phone. And then I'm going to show you guys what I got from the flea market. So I don't know if you guys have flea markets in your area or if you even know what I'm talking about. kind of sounds weird but it's basically like a big vendor market. Um, so they have like fruits, vegetables, handmade items. They have like stuff that people collect like couponing that they just resell for a cheaper price. Um, and I had been looking for some handmade masks because the one that I have is just unbearably thick that I cannot even breathe out of it. So I found this lady and she makes these super cute um, masks and they are double lined and they do have the filter, but she said the filter is removable and you can breathe easier without the filter in them. So this is the one that I picked up for Manny because we love um, Nightmare Before Christmas. It also has the wire in it, which is nice because it kind of you know forms around the nose. And then I got myself, I got this one, which has like little daisies on it. I got this cute little Harry Potter one. Love Harry Potter. And then I got myself also a matching Nightmare Before Christmas one. So as you can see here, this is the opening and then this is the filter. So it just comes right out like that. Um, and of course these are washable and reusable. So I do like to have the disposable masks, but it's nice to have these on hand too when you can't find any. Cause I have a feeling once flu season starts, those masks, pff, they're gonna be gone. All right, so next I'm gonna show you guys what I picked up from the Dollar Tree because the Dollar Tree, I don't know about y'all, but it just gets me every time. They have such cute stuff. Um, so the first thing that I picked up from there were these molds, these little dinosaur molds. So you can put like candy in there, jello, you can put ice cubes, pretty much anything that can be molded you can put in there. And this was only a dollar, like what? That's just crazy to me. Um, I also got this cute little, another witch hat. It says, welcome my pretties. It's just a little plaque that you can like, again, put on a shelf or a tiered tray. Um, I got these cute little witch hat stickers. They are um, DIY. They're actually like a wood type material. Um, I just thought these would be cute for either a DIY project or just to stick around on, I mean, anything really. I also picked up some of this. <laughs> so this is just decorative nautical rope. I have a fun DIY coming up that I'm going to be using that. And then I grabbed some of these ribbons and twine. I thought this would be a cute um, option for my stacked books. As I mentioned earlier, just these like, these are kind of spring colors. I might save these for spring, but I thought these were super cute. They have like the macrame looking stuff on them. So that could be an option for the books as well. And then these right here, these were such a fun find that I absolutely had to get them. And I wanted to get all of them because they had quite a few more that were very cute. But I only picked up two. So these are like the little, I don't know, the wine glasses or whatever you want to call them. They're just drinking glasses. 
you can drink wine out of them too. But this one says Creep It Real, which I think is so funny and so cute. And it has like a little spider on it. Oh, I love it. I don't know about you guys. And I say that a lot because I don't know about you guys. But I'm obsessed with Halloween. Like fall, psh, Thanksgiving, psh, couldn't care less really. But Halloween, I look forward to Halloween every single year. Halloween and Christmas are my most favorite holidays. Um, but Halloween, Halloween used to be in the lead, but in, when I had a child, Christmas kind of took over for that a little bit, but they're like neck and neck and I still love Halloween. And then the other one that I got was this, and it says, keep calm and carry a wand. And it has bats and a witch hat and I love vampires as well. So I love bats. And I just thought these were super cute just to have like, you know, have a little drink out of. Next, I'm going to show you guys what I picked up from Ross and Marshalls. So I got Manny this super cute Mickey Mouse shirt. And it looks like that. And I just thought that was so precious. And yes, it's a t-shirt, but... We live in South Carolina and it is usually warm well into October, sometimes even November. So I figured he could get a little bit of wear out of this. He can always throw this on under a jacket or under a um, sweatshirt and still wear it into the winter. Next thing I picked up was I got this cute little gown. So I got this cute little gown for myself and it's just like leopard print. And it's actually got little hearts in the leopard print and it's like super soft and I just love gowns because they're super comfy to sleep in. So huh, leopard print, I picked that up. And then I also got myself this really cute, um, it's like a rust colored shirt and then it has like the little detail I don't know what you call that, a little twisty detail on the top. And it's just like an oversized comfy shirt to wear with like leggings or jeans or whatever. Again, this is something that I can wear now and I can wear in the fall. I grabbed Manny some of these good to grow drinks. I just love these because number one, I wash and reuse these and they don't leak and they have fun characters on them. And the good to grow uh, juice is like, you know, it's pretty good, no sugar added all that jazz. So I picked up those for him. Um, these are the, what do they call this thing? I don't even know who these characters are, but man, he doesn't care, even though he doesn't watch that, but he doesn't care. He loves them. Okay. And at Marshall's, um, I picked up these two books for Manny. They're like little Halloween books. He is like currently obsessed with Halloween and like all things spooky, child after my own heart. <laughs> so I picked him up these cute little Halloween books. This one's just like trick or treat and it's got the little flaps and this one is peekaboo and it has like the little things in it so you can like see the next page and stuff like that. And then I got this which I am obsessed with. I'm obsessed with these. I want to buy like a hundred more and hang them all over my house but I got a macrame planting pot. Is that what it's called? Da, 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 planter. So it looks like this. It's got the little hang things and I don't know. I just think that's so cute. I can't decide if I'm gonna put this in my living room or if I'm gonna put this in our bedroom, but I just love it so much and I definitely want to pick up more of these. They had some that were a little bit smaller, but I'm looking for like the really low hanging ones that are a little bit bigger. Um, yeah, so I love this and I'm so excited to put it up and I just don't know where to put it yet. And it was like super affordable. It was $10. So if you're looking for something like that, I highly recommend going to like TJ Maxx or Marshalls because you're gonna get more bang for your buck because I feel like those things on Etsy go for like $40. <laughs> so anyway, so you guys, that's everything that I got over the weekend. That's my little fall haul for you guys. Um, 
you know, I definitely had some fall related items and some Halloween related items that I wanted to share with you guys. And I just wanted to share some other fun little things that I picked up. And you know what is the greatest thing of all is I didn't break the bank. I went to the Dollar Tree, TJ Maxx, Ross, Target. Those places are all where you can find very affordable things. Yeah, I'm very excited about all the new stuff that we got. And I hope you guys are too. And if you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already, and as always, thanks for being my kind of weird. Bye!